Hello friends, welcome to CyberCAD Solutions. I am Prabhu and in this session I would like to explain what is the difference between world coordinate system and user coordinate system that is difference between WCS and UCS. We all know that when we create a new drawing we will get a default layer, zero layer on which we can directly start drawing entities. Now this world coordinate system also comes by default so when we are working with 3D modeling many times uh, we may require our xy plane parallel to different faces different faces on a 3d model so in such cases we will be using ucs command and we will be changing the ucs as required sometimes same ucs we may require multiple times to finish the model so in such cases we can save the ucs with a name so that is called as user coordinate system and the world coordinate system is the standard one which we cannot change it so once you finish working with the user coordinate system you can get back to WCS let us see how to create a UCS and how to get back to world coordinate system so let me change this plane to 3d model I am taking 3d wo command to orbit this and you can see I am just trying to rotate this plane like this now you can see x y plane on the bottom and z is towards upside let's take wedge command and i am drawing wedge like this now i want to create a hole over here which is perpendicular to this face so for that one if you try to draw a circle current drafting plane x y plane is at the bottom face so if you try to create a circle it will come on x y plane like this so to change this x y plane parallel to this face we will be using UCS command so take UCS command and take face option and click on the required face and make sure the face which you want to select which you have selected is the correct one or not if not you can go for the next face next face like that until you get the required one okay once you get the required one you can see the highlighted blue color edges once the required one is selected you just press enter to finish the selection now if you see the xy plane has changed to parallel to this face now if you try to draw a circle you can see that is coming parallel to this uh, parallel to this face now now let us try to create a cylinder so type cyl and uh, i am clicking over here we can directly click on this face also there are different options and uh, if you start drawing on this face itself directly ucs will also change but i want to explain you what is the use of user coordinate system that's why i am trying to draw this cross section outside the face so let us take cyl command and click over here and this much radius i am taking and i am extruding this cylinder like this now let's go to f4 means 3d object snap on and let's go to object snap also and make sure that uh, 3d object snap center of the face is switched on or not now i am switching this on and say ok now move this cylinder from this center face to this center okay now try to subtract this subtract from object is this to object is this now you can see a hole is created which is perpendic perpendicular to the selected plane okay now if you want to save this ucs you can save this ucs by selecting this and right click and go to named ucs and say save select the save now here if you see on the command prompt it is asking enter the name to save i am giving say phase 1 okay now to get back to the world coordinate system simply take UCS command there you have world option already there just click on that and it will get back to the original coordinate system you can see the UCS icon which is returned back to the original so again if you want to come back to the phase 1 coordinate system means phase 1 user coordinate system you simply go on to this UCS icon and right click go to the named UCS and select phase 1 you can see it's changed so this is user coordinate system and if you want to get back to the world coordinate system simply take UCS command and take world option so that you can get back to the world coordinate system now if you want to delete the phase 1 user coordinate system you can do that one just go to UCS command and take named option and in that take delete option and here type phase 1 okay so deleted one ucs whose name is phase one you can see that at the com command prompt 
okay so now hope you understood what is the difference between world coordinate system and user coordinate system world coordinate system cannot be deleted it is the default one automatically comes when you create a new drawing just like our zero layer and user coordinate system is the coordinate system which is created from the world coordinate system it can be created by rotating any axis from the existing world coordinate system okay so now the world coordinate system is the standard one and the user coordinate system is a temporary one which is created for a temporary purpose once we finish using them we can delete or leave them as they are but to get back to the world coordinate system the same ucs command you can use and come back to the world coordinate system by taking world option in the ucs command friends hope you understood what is the difference between world coordinate system and user coordinate system to create user coordinate system you can take different options in the ucs command you can use any face option or you can take any object or you can rotate any axis so x or y or z axis you can rate, rotate any axis to get your required user coordinate system okay friends friends hope you understood what is the difference between world coordinate system and user coordinate system friends if you like this video please subscribe to my channel and share this video to your friends thanks for watching and welcome to the next session